Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is still Monday, January 6th, 2020. This is 2020. Uh, I'm the Drunk Poker, it's still beer time. Again, we, we stopped at a, a random LCBO today on the way home from work and found a bunch of beers that we had never seen before. From our friends at, uh, what's this again? Oh, September 30th, 2019. From our friends at Lake of the Woods. Are you in the woods? Born and bred in the north. Nautical disaster. Dry hopped IPA. 6.4%. 55 IBUs. American style IPA. Uh, so, uh, I love road trips. I mean, we didn't do a lot last year. Time and circumstance plays a role in everything. Um, one of the places I really, really want to go, because it is Ontario's northernmost and Westernmost brewery is Lake of the Woods, deep in the woods, born and bred in the north. Um, we really want to go there. So hopefully we make that happen this summer. I don't know. Lots of dreams happening. But anyways, it's nice to see a beer from these guys. We've had a few from them before. Uh, we've got some friends up in the area. So, uh, yeah, I mean, nautical disaster now. Many, you know, I'm a giant hip fan. Gord Downey lot, mean, means a lot to me. Uh, Day for Night is my favorite hip album. Nautical disaster is one of my favorite hip songs. So, and I do love a good IPA. So, let's hope. Here's hoping. You know, life is funny. Eh? I had no idea I was going to find all these beers today. And when I did, I kind of went, well, I know what I'm doing for the next couple of days. And that's okay, too. Um, I don't really plan stuff out. I'm not good at it. And I kind of just go on a whim all the time, whatever the whim takes me. I really got to learn to pour less because I can't sniff. Orange and grapefruit. Okay, a little pine. That's good. I mean, I'm, I'm hoping. I, I love a classic IPA. Um, mostly because it delivers m memories on top of beer. And let's face it, you want to call a beer nautical disaster, I'm going to be on the YouTubes later tonight watching hip songs, feeling nostalgic. Cheers, my friends. Lake of the Woods. Born and bred in the north, deep in the woods. Cheers. So that's certainly leaning westy. Not full west, and they didn't call it a West Coast IPA. Thank you very much. Dry hopped IPA. Very good. Very, a uh, lot of citrus pith on the front end. Um, orange grapefruit. Bit of pineapple. Definitely a pithy citrus, uh, piney citrus back end. Piney citrus back end. I mean, piney pithy. Yeah, yeah. It's the bitterness. It's nice. Surprisingly, uh, almost crushable for that ABV which is good and dangerous. Dange is my middle name. thought it was poke. No, I just made that up. Um, no, it's, it's actually quite good. Um, if, you like, if you like to lean a little more classic, um, a touch of floral hops, it's, it's quite good. And I think the, the label's cool. I mean, Nautical Disaster. It's, it's not named after the song. There's a whole story about, uh, you know, Steamships going down, and, and, and I mean, let's say it's based on lakes and, and that. So, but I mean, if you're a Canadian hip fan, you know where you're leaning on this one. I know where I'm leaning, and that's okay. That's that, that's fine too. Uh, memory and beer goes together. There's nothing like reminiscing with a few beers, talking about the old days and things you did, and things you loved, and uh, I'm okay with that. So it's a good beer. Look for the local LCBO. Happen to find it. Um, it is more old school, definitely. A little nod to new school, but I'd say it's mostly old school. And there's something to be said for that. It's nice to see that at the LCBO. I, I know, again, the LCBO aging program, there's there's issues. I, I, I'm not going to fix that. I'm not even going to bother trying. I'm going to tell you a beer I find, beer I like, beer I enjoy. I'm like the woods, deep in the woods, born and bred in the north. Cheers. Good. 